We're now going to add video to Google Maps with a real-time GPS push pin. So I'm using AZ Screen Recorder and Google Maps on Android. To get started, what we need to do is just configure the webcam, which I'm using as a oval circle thing, and then we get started. Maybe introduction with just a full screen, which is the regular, uh, maybe a portrait as well. Then switching over to Maps, and what I'm trying to pay attention to is the push pin, which is blue, where I'm actually standing. And then remember this is a pioneering experiment, so I've gone over to satellite view and I've started to walk. At this point, just for your ease, I'm speeding up the video by four times. Watch on the right hand side and you'll see the blue push pin which is now moving towards the retail area and I've zoomed in. What I'm paying particular attention is can I see something in the circular webcam remember which is mirrored until I can actually swap it over maybe from the AZ screen recorder app which isn't a feature I don't think at the moment. Oh there we go look we're, we're fast again and now you can see that blue push pin at four times really speeding along giving some intelligence that we are moving just pushed it over to 3D a little bit there I've just um, slanted the screen so I'm going and straddling the side of the building and going down and we've got up-to-date information as the um, the gym health center thing and then we're finishing up over the river bridge so that was how I did it with the raw video clips and then remember we could pop back this is just finishing off with the there we go I can change this to a square and I did a little go where if I did look at a square at the university at the road it looks like this I don't think the square or the rectangle looks as good as maybe the oval but that, that's up to you and then remember I made a Google Photos movie which looked like this with the automatic movie music which was about 23 seconds if you want to learn more about this then what you need to do if you wish to is to go to the Google Local Guides collection where you're going to find more information and the posts that I'm working on with these new ideas to represent the world that we live in. So there you go, and see you next time in the next video.